Welcome to this X8R video detailing our BMW N47 Manifold Swirl Flap Removal Kit. Our kit consists of a small black spacer, a bung for the hole left by the swirl flap rod, and four new gaskets to replace the old BMW gaskets. The N47 manifold is problematic as the swirl flaps can deteriorate and break over time, leading to parts going into the engine which can cause catastrophic engine failure. The swirl flaps can also get clogged up with carbon and fail to rotate sometimes. For this repair, you will need a large flathead screwdriver, a pick tool, a pair of long nose pliers, and a Torx T30 screwdriver. We would also recommend having a hammer to hand. The first task is to remove the three screws attaching the motor to the manifold. You will need your Torx T30 screwdriver for this task. Once the screws are released, remove the motor from the manifold. The next task is to remove the metal retaining clip. We would recommend using your large flathead screwdriver to pry this out of position. With the clip out of the way, it is now time to remove the rod. Do this using your long nose pliers. It should hopefully slide out fairly easily. But if not, we recommend holding the manifold in a vise and then using your pliers to pull out the rod. In the space left by the rod, there is a rubber o ring which will need to be pulled out of position. Do this using the pick tool. You can now go about removing the swirl flaps themselves. We recommend using your flathead screwdriver and your hammer to gently tap at the edges of the swirl flaps to loosen them. Then, using your long nose pliers, carefully remove the remnants of the swirl flap from the hole. As you can see on the removed swirl flaps, they are completely covered in carbon deposits and will not work efficiently anymore. Next, using your pick tool, remove the old gaskets from the manifold. You can now fit our replacement gaskets. Using the notch on the gasket and the space on the manifold, locate the gaskets in their correct positions and press in firmly. You can now install our bung to plug the hole left by the rod, creating a seal. 
This should push in and will be very secure if installed correctly. On the previously removed motor, disconnect the swirl flap rod rotating arm as this is no longer needed. When refitting the motor, the bung should fit snugly against the motor. If it does not and there is a gap left, as shown here, you will need to fit our spacer. Fit this to the end of the bung that is already installed. And now place the small black spacer on the end of the greased bung. You can now line up the screw holes on the motor with the manifold and using your Torx T30 screwdriver, reinstall the three screws. Once the screws are in, that is the repair complete. Remember to reconnect the motor once the manifold is installed in the car. Thank you for watching this X8R video. If you have any questions or need any advice, please contact us on 01843 446643 or email us on sales at x8r.co.uk. Thank you.